Hey performers, I'm Sean Royer. I'm a talent development specialist here in Los Angeles, California. I help singers and actors achieve their show business dreams every day in person at my LA studios or online. Today we're going to talk about what it takes to become a great singer. And we're going to go back to my psychology days and talk about the four stages of learning. But before we talk about singing, I want to talk about sports. Let's say you're a basketball player and you're doing a layup. There are several small steps that go into doing a layup correctly. Not, not only is it bouncing the ball, it's about taking the appropriate amount of steps, it's about foot placements and arm placement before you actually shoot the ball. Singing is a complex process as well, and to be able to do singing correctly, it takes consistent practice over time. Well, there are four stages of learning. Stage one of the learning process is called unconscious incompetence. And that's when you don't know that you don't know. So let's, like, let's say you just love to sing and you sing to the radio. You think you sound good. People around you, even like your mom, even your mama tells you you sound good. All right, so now we have stage two, which is called conscious incompetence, okay? So let's say you've been singing and then you go for an audition, let's say for your school choir, you try out for American Idol. And after your audition, someone says, you know what, you better take some singing lessons. And for you to tell me that I need lessons? Tamika, Tamika. 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 It's Tamika. 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 So that's when you know that you don't know. Okay? You, you know that you don't know how to sing. Stage three is called conscious incompetence. That's when you've been going to voice lessons for a while and you start to really learn what you're doing. And you're pretty sounding pretty good. Your mama and your grandmama t tell you so. Now you're doing it pretty well, but it's taking a lot of concentration to do it correctly. So that's called conscious incompetence. And then stage four of learning is called unconscious competence. And that's just when you do it. You go on stage, you sing a song, and you just do it. You don't have to worry about your breathing technique. You don't have to worry about uh, the notes. You have just learned how to sing and do the process correctly. So those are the four stages of learning. And I want you to think about this as you're beginning your singing journey with me because it's important that you don't get ahead of yourself because everyone has to go through these stages of learning to be able to do something very, really well. Now along the journey, some of you might be at unconscious incompetence, or some of you might have already had voice lessons, so you're at conscious incompetence. So those are the four stages of learning. If you found this information helpful, go ahead and like and subscribe. Until next time, I'm Sean Royer, and when you count the stars, I hope you count yourself first.